Today, I'm going to show you how to download homebrew apps straight from your Wii U. To do this, we're just going to be using the homebrew app store. So getting started, go to the link in the description, and it should take you to this page here where it says homebrew app store, and just on the right side, click download, and it should download a, a WinRAR file. You will need an extraction software, I use WinRAR because it's free. Uh, just open up that app store file, pull up your SD card. So just drag this Wii U folder onto the root of your SD card. And once that's transferred, go into your Wii U folder, go into apps, and then you should see app store right there. And that's all we need to do on the computer. So I'll meet you over on the Wii U. Once you're over on your Wii U, you're going to have to be in your custom firmware. I'm running Tiramisu right now. So I'm just going to go into the Mii Maker, which is the homebrew launcher. And it should be as easy as that. You should see Homebrew App Store right here. Now, to download apps, you do need an internet connection. But otherwise, just click it and load it up. And this will help you skip the process of putting your SD card in your computer and downloading it from there because you can download it straight from your Wii U. So, as you can see, you have a whole selection of different apps that you can download. So let's just go through this and try to pick something out. <laughs> Look at that flappy preview. So let's just let's do this one. Just press A, and then you can read about it, and just press A to download. And it's as easy as that. You can do it. It's like it's like an eShop on your homebrew channel. So it makes it very simple. And if you ever want to delete it, you can go onto your SD card, and you should see it there. But it's very simple. So let's go see if it worked just gonna click the minus button to quit and we're back here and there it is just like that we have a flappy bird game on our Wii U <laughs> all right that's enough so as you can tell it's a very simple tutorial so I hope you're able to follow it if you ran into any issues just let me know and I'll try to help also, I've opened my own Discord server, so that'll be linked below if you want to join. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.